Hi, my name is Juliet Herr and I am a current Donnelly student. I've always really wanted to go to college, like ever since I was little, that was like an immediate thing I always wanted to do. Um, not just to go, but also finish, because I do know a lot of people in my family who did go to college, but they never graduated, they dropped out. So that was like always a go-getter plan for me. It's really funny because um, I actually didn't really know I wanted to go because uh, the pandemic just started for my senior year because I graduated 2020 and it was crazy. I had no idea what I was going to do. And it was actually my college advisor, the, co the counselor at my high school that suggested for me to go. So I went because I'm like, I might as well see what Donnelly College is about. I thought Donnelly was a perfect fit. And Donnelly has a really amazing scholarship that I applied for and I was able to get. And I'm super thankful for that because again, it pays for a lot of my education here. But of course, you know, money is always a hard kind of thing to swallow when you realize just how expensive that is. Donnelly has really helped me with that because it's given me more hope in terms of my education and really given me more hope in terms of what I can change in the world. While I am studying right now, I'm just going for my associates, but I'm hoping to study further into biology with an emphasis in biomedical sciences. I'm really hoping to actually be a doctor. I think the pandemic really brought into a lot of reality of just how much people in the medical career really go through. And so for me, it kind of brought in that reality. It's like, hey, I want to help with this problem as well. It's something as big as pandemic, as something as small as just trying to help um, other people within a small town. I think Donnelly is honestly a really wonderful school. If you ask around, though, like, I actually acknowledge that, you know, Donnelly really looks and takes care of both the students and faculty. And I know like, one of the main pillars for Donnelly is actually excellence, um, which I think is absolutely amazing because they bring excellence, not in just their students, but anybody of all ages, of all ethnicities, of all types, um, and really bringing them out into a bigger world and helping them through that. And I think it's pretty amazing though to, to just see that, you know, I'm not alone here. There's actually people here supporting me and encouraging me. And it's great to see just how much, um, I guess, determination really to really push these students forward towards a better future. So I am a first generation student. It's a never ending process to just be like a first generation student not having that much access to well, what it's like being a college student because like my parents never went to college. They came to the United States and they hoped that we, their children, would receive the, the, the education that they need. And luckily I, I got that opportunity. The first generation it also comes with doubt. You know, like sometimes there are days where I feel like, am I really up to, you know, am I doing, am I doing what I'm supposed to do or do I, do I really deserve the things that I've gotten? I really want to give credit to like those uh, professors, faculty who really put in time and really believed in me because it's like there was a point in time I didn't believe in myself. There are some people who, who work so hard that sometimes they don't even get the things that they want. And, and, th and that's the reason why I do the work, because they deserve opportunities. I want to see my community better than it already is. And that's, that's the reason why I want to go to architecture school and come back to Wainak County and like hopefully that I'm able to pro at least provide those resources to the people who need it the most. My professor, Dr. Paula Consul Shoykan, she has been just a really huge inspiration. She is the reason why there I have gotten the opportunities that I've gotten. One of the reasons why, uh, because she's always pushed me to turn those applications in, do the things that I said I was going to do, um, and just hold me accountable when I when I needed to be held accountable. I feel like that I don't have a lot of words to say because she's just done so much for me. Same for Yvonne Taleb. She gave me like an opportunity to be a tutor. And from there, she just kept opening doors for me. It's those type of professors and um, advisors and the faculty that, that really make a student. 
all those opportunities that I've gotten from from just even being able, being able to co-found a an organization here at Donnelly or to even be the intern at, at HDF, something that I that honestly never thought I would have done. Like I want to give thanks to all those who who really believed in me, who saw me, who saw my story, who saw not just my name, but like who I am. Like if you would have told me a year ago I would be doing all this work, I, I, would, I, would, I wouldn't even believe it because it, it really was life changing. And yeah, like I think, yeah, I think I, I want to give huge thanks to like the people here at Donnelly and the people who have supported me along the way.